しようぜ江戸天聖Fan, make sure I'll go ahead and check out our Patreon for exclusive Come access on. to full length reactions and some exclusive reactions that don't even hit YouTube. Make sure I'll go ahead and click that link. Appreciate y'all and back to your record schedule program. Don't let go. Uh, it's it's pretty good, man. It's back and forth it's pretty, games. pretty good. I ain't mad at it. I'm not mad at it at all, bro. You know. I'm not keep up the great work, man. For I'm real. trying. Man. Go see a vocal coach in my free time, aka the mirror. Mmm, that'd be great. I'm trying to at least get the get my pitch like the weekend, so I can at least sound sort of good. Oh, just, see, enough, nah, to nah, sell, nah. just mm. enough to sell millions? Nah, bro. See, when you like the weekend, you either got it or you don't, man. Your voice going to do but so many octaves. If, it's ain't, if it ain't built for that, bro, you can't learn that. They told me I could be whatever I wanted to be in school. They lie. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's just something okay. they tell kids to motivate them so they can become <laughs> semi-productive members of society. And then once they realize they can't con you know, complete those dreams, they then become <laughs> a villain. And then they start doing things that make them unproductive member of society. So, yeah. It's kind of counterintuitive if you think about it. It's just like the whole dare program. Yeah, I mean, you're just giving people false hopes and dreams. It's like, yeah, you can be whatever you want to be. No, you can't. No, you can't. It takes a certain person to do a certain type of thing. All right? Not everybody's booked to do that certain type of thing. That's, That's just true. a fact. That's you can true. become that way, but you have to have the motivation. And you have to want to do that. You know what I'm saying? That is But true. if you want to be a singer, them certain octaves you just can't touch, man. That you can't. Some, sometimes you got to settle for, you know... Give you on instead of the weekend. You gotta do kind of like a bellow opposed to just a harmonic sound. So, yeah. You know your octaves too. That's really fucking. I don't know them. I just know that there's. I think like what, like six or eight or yeah. something. I can't fucking. You threw out the, the the two furthest ones, I believe. Yeah, yeah, I understand. So basically, told a nigga like me as an elephant to climb a tree. Yeah, like obviously an elephant can't climb a tree, man. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Young got thumbs. They have thumbs. They can probably climb that tree. It's gonna have to be a big tree, bro. Niggas be hella fucking scared they can climb trees. <laughs> them niggas gonna kill niggas just off the principle. Excuse me, just gonna shimmy. They just gonna climb up the tree, wait for niggas to walk by. Tee hee. Oh, back in the they gonna soup. Now like, they gonna bitch. <laughs> just the trust fall. I'm like, get your big ass out of the tree, niggas. See? Okay, I will. <laughs> mm -mm. I don't like it. <laughs> right, we should never thought of that fucking shit. I'm sorry. Uh, speaking of thinking of shit, I'm gonna think of these characters' names. What's going on, Ram and Family? It's Sherman Kage, Mr. BFB. That's true. Classroom of the Elite, episode six. Um. Yeah, that's right up there. That's right up there. I'll check it, man. Uh, I'll check it. You know, I'll be forgetting sometimes. No, you, you know. and me both. Um, we're still in the sports festival sports festival arc. We yeah. saw that. We skipped some stuff, apparently, too. I saw. Niggas is pissed. Listen, suppose this is the episode. The one the one they were outsourcing the other ones for, for this one. Yeah, I. Um, Anya, on, I'm going to call this nigga Anya Koji. But I'm skipping a syllable. Ayana Koji. Ayana Koji um, was basically up to his usual scheme, finding out which person he wanted to scheme with next, while his, uh, I'm not going to say his equal, his female equal was being duped and tricked into coming to the nurse's office like a fucking idiot. Listen, Horikata is nowhere near this nigga's equal. I was nowhere being nice. Near. I was just being You're, nice. No, you were being... Charitable. That's what you were okay. being. Okay. That, that was beyond nice, bro. Because I was like, oh, stupid ass hoe, but. Damn. Cause like, so now you're just being mean. Well, because you knew the girl <laughs> that's a traitor told you pop up at the nurse's office and you went with it. Yeah. There's no, no amount of sweat or lack of thought you wouldn't be like, oh shit. I sh this nigga did say she was a traitor and she's telling me to go to the nurse's office right now after what just happened. I, you know what? It's a great idea. I should great go with idea. it. Let's, let's see what's going on. idea. Fucking dumb. Dude. Obviously, I got some land for her in Africa to sell. Nice. Hit it, Jack. You gonna sell her a beach in Idaho? I'm gonna sell an airport that this this nigga from Nigeria was selling to people. He was selling the airport, and when niggas went to go land, hey, bro, adversity is the first path to truth. 
I literally was like, where this nigga that from? <laughs> I was like, I'll get you every episode, bro. Because <laughs> I forget they do that shit. Oh. <laughs> What's your fine ass move? <laughs> That's what he's thinking. Oh, yeah, he punched somebody. Mm-hmm. Slapped him punch? I don't know what he it sounds like. Him. Sound like a slap. <laughs> the fuck does y'all think he is? It's fucking high school. And I hear girls too, by the way. You how saw it out there earlier. How tall is the building that the elevator ain't come yet? <laughs> <laughs> yep, here we go. He definitely like he hit women, bro. Steroids. I'm going to a roid rage. Steroids! <laughs> <laughs> Chris, Chris <laughs> Benoit. Damn, dog. Come on, man. Oh, good. They gave two of those guys life sentences that killed um, Ahmaud Arbery. Fuck yeah. Throw the niggas under the jail. <laughs> and then you got punched in your jaw and you ain't know what to do. I feel that, bro. Not to mention, I have been kind of depressed lately. This nigga want some attention? Nah, nigga. Bro, just drink some black coffee, back into your parking spots, you'll get all the attention in the fucking world. People drink black coffee for attention and people back in the spots for attention. I can't do it for safety? Nah, nigga, you gotta fucking lift the car. You can drive over a curb, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Depending on where you park, of course. Bars. <laughs> Nothing, I'm just... <laughs> Let me break it down for I'm you. I'm just deflecting. <laughs> Coming from worthless herself. Look at the pot calling the kettle black. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. You just came from a setup talking to a nigga like this. Like... <laughs> Except for that, I need some food. Oh, they were on lunch break. Yo, just flash this nigga, bro. <laughs> a man do anything to see some breasts, like, at this age? <laughs> she she stood there for three hours. She don't want to win that bad. <laughs> he better drag her like no fucking other. <laughs> Cut the fucking act. She's not that dumb. Like <laughs> he said, now nah, I'm gonna hit you upside the head. Stop fucking playing. Hypotheticals, <laughs> guilty as fuck. The fact that you're explaining all this to me means that you're the fucking traitor. <laughs> you about to flip the switch? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, about that. points, I believe. I lied. She did wait there for three hours. <laughs> That's crazy. Uh, 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 uh. Alright, you playing with the wrong person. <laughs> okay. So be it. You sealed your fate. You about to drag the shit out. Oh, she waited an hour? Jesus Christ. What kind of ningen you are? You both want acknowledgement. That sucker bass is my brother. <laughs> Nigga just walking. That's disrespectful. <laughs> you gotta run while I'm walking just to keep me in eyesight. It's also for me to think you're running behind me too. Why is that your brother for? Blame your parents. 
Should have had an extra kid you can stay back with. <laughs> Birth another loser? Yeah. <laughs> Look at them forming them bond. Cause you can relate, bro. She gonna call this nigga, bro. She slapped herself that hard. It's violent. You know what they say, bro. Hook, line, and sinker. Hook, line, and sinker. About what? What are we hook, line, and sinker? The plan, nigga. Oh, oh, him as a tool. Oh, yeah, I told <laughs> you damn right it is, loser. Nigga, he punched you in your jaw and you suck a dick, this are bad. Like, come on, bro. The meat riding is ridiculous. It's ridiculous, my God. <laughs> of course. She's gonna sabotage the shit. I thought they, oh, did it? So they didn't show us the, the race then. He's got weak ass lower halves of the body. They like, got Jesus, them curry ankles. Ayana Koji. Oh, they're not that far back. They made it seem like they was like down bad. I guess it depends on how much 100 points is. But the fact they got to 9,000 or something, I guess, speaks volumes of <laughs> how easy it is. Yeah. Bang. Just wait till uh, Kushida gets in the play, into the fray. This nigga about to skirt off. <laughs> we about to smoke this nigga. <laughs> and this is where it falls apart. <laughs> They're waiting. He about to dust this Whoa. nigga, boy. They catching up to niggas? No way. And this nigga got the same thing. Such special running past these niggas. Oh, my gosh. Hey, yo, you see this? <laughs> <laughs> these niggas is gone, bro. Oh, shit. Bro, these niggas ain't even changing their breath, bro. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> these niggas both stale face running, bro. It's just... <laughs> Excuse me? Y'all gonna bullshit us like that? Okay, cool. Oh, they won? Yeah. Pretty fast. Diana Koji! <laughs> Get over here! <laughs> He's like, fuck, I stuck out too much. But so, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, they don't look like NPCs, this one, but like. Because <laughs> this nigga ran. <laughs> and they didn't even show us the end result of the race. <laughs> and they didn't show us the race, the, uh, the two legged race either. Nope. We saw something tied. <sighs> <laughs> no, thank you. No problem. Anytime you need me to demean you and degrade you, I'm here. Spit on you? I do that too. Oh, this is why it's the episode. Right here. This 10 second clip. It's obvious. All right, you're going to sit here Kirby face the whole fucking time? All right, bet. Mm. Oh. 
There we go. That's the bitch we know. She, she used to put back on that face she had when she was being fake good. Mm -hmm. She looked old as shit. Because you have the power to do that? I broke her leg. Oh, I didn't see this coming. What an idiot. Yeah, I'm going to reveal my trump card in front of everybody. Fuck it. A double double cross. <laughs> she like a dope hair, bro. Oh, she about to be pissed. <laughs> nigga, you can put two and two together. She's always with Ayana Koji. If you're as smart as you think you are, you can literally piece it together, nigga. <laughs> you're doing the thing again, bro. You're doing the thing again. Look, she ready. <laughs> Your stupid ass. <laughs> and then Shizune sitting here talking about, oh, you best to be this time. Yeah, because you had the IQ with fucking cucumber the whole fucking arc. Like, what are we talking about here? I love it. <laughs> episode six was that episode, but not because I was. No, the, the end. The end was what made it that episode. The fact that Iona Koji predicted all this shit so and still end, had the end saved the whole episode. Huh? The end saved the whole episode. Uh, I wouldn't say that the episode was ruined. It wasn't a bad episode. There yeah. were just elements that I wish they would have shown more of, like the race, like the conclusion of the race, like yeah. showing what Some actually happened. Some more races, if anything. Yeah, like you took the time to sit here and have the, the characters have a conversation about the end of the race, but you couldn't just animate the race. The race, like, it, it, it really wouldn't have taken much more animation. 15 seconds max. It took more for them to do that white zoom in shit they were doing with the... <laughs> no, that was, that was easy, nigga. These <laughs> niggas said, hey, we're going to do some Gintama shit. We're going to do a little filler frame, you know what I'm saying? Just kind of fade it out, and then they're just going to get what we give them. <laughs> There's no way they outsource for this. There was no crazy animation in this. There's, there was no need to outsource. Ayana Koji has been fucking amazing through and through. I wonder who the traitor is in Class C now that Ayana Koji is fucking just doing this guy. I don't know. Still facing everything. Shows no emotion. I don't know. Like, at least when you're running, you at least... I don't know. When I used to run. You was around, you was a track star? I was, actually. 100, nice. 204 by 4. Indoor? Outdoor. Mm. I never, indoor was more high school, and that's when I stopped running track. Mm -hmm. That's when the black dad starts sucking all the fun out of everything. Because it's like, college, you need to be getting a scholarship, you need to be training, you need to be running. Niggas you need get to track be... scholarships in college? You need... If you're an athlete, you can get a scholarship for anything if you're an athlete. I had no fucking clue, bro. I had no idea yeah. they paid niggas to run niggas, in college. Yeah, niggas. Like, hey, bro, you you fast? Hey, you hockey, want a scholarship, my nigga? Hockey players get it. Field hockey oh, players hockey, get yeah, it. Hockey, yeah, like hockey. I can see it. Well, field hockey, yeah. Cheerleaders get scholarships? Yeah, it's a sport, technically. Really? Cheerleading is a sport. I'm not, I'm not doubting it's a sport, but I just didn't know that they got yeah. scholarships specifically for cheering. Mm -hmm. Like, they have scouts for cheerleaders? Like, no, nah, it's like a truck. Maybe. Or do you, you just know, apply? They, they like... do the they do the competition shit on other shit, you know what I mean? Yeah. 
Huh. Interesting. Yeah. The more you know. The more you fucking know. They got scars for everything. Yeah. Well, that was a fun episode. Ayana, Ayana Koji, he he did it again. I wonder who the traitor is in Class C. I said that. Um, and just for him to, like, know what she's about to go do, this guy's only 10 steps ahead. We said that before, though. I don't even know if it's necessarily knowing what someone's going to do. I think he makes these things happen in anticipation of what they will do. Because he's like, mm. he's forcing their hand to do certain things. Like, he's basically constantly forcing them in checkmate. He's like, there's no possible other option that you can take. Because he knew that Kikyo's uh, need for revenge was that, you know, overpowering. That yeah. she would throw all common sense out the window. She would do any and everything to achieve this specific goal. Yeah. So he was like, since I know she's like this, I'm going to place these pieces Around. out there as feelers, as traps. And she's going to bite, and she has no choice other than to bite because it's a checkmate kind of move. Nice. So he's What's the back between them? them in middle school, though? I wonder we, when we get that. I have no idea. Maybe next episode, hopefully. Maybe she said something to her that rubbed her the wrong way in middle school yeah. or something. Or maybe I mean, she was the number one girl in middle school and homegirl came in second. Yeah, I don't know. She said she was a problem child, so I'm trying to figure out what she meant by that, like what she was doing to become a problem child. Like, was it just you were like a troublemaker and you were causing issues for people or like you were a bully and then, Hor- you know, Horikata beat your ass real quick or something in front of everybody. Like, what was it? What school, what, what show was that homeboy beat it, somebody up for the girl Ishigami. he liked? Kaguya-sama. Something like that. Mm-hmm. Sure. Yeah, and then they, <laughs> I'm like, oh, he, Ishigami's a bully, this, that, the third. And I'm like, nigga, I'm, <laughs> I'm a nobody and I just beat somebody ass and now all of a sudden I'm a bully. You niggas ain't care shit about me until this nigga bullied me and then I started whooping his ass. <laughs> like, Cause, what? Uh, he started Because sh- he was cheating on the girl I liked. Mm-hmm. And he confronted him about it and he was like, nigga, you ain't gonna do shit about it. <laughs> well, no, that was actually fun. Yeah, that was a good, it was a little good sports episode, festival, That's probably the worst sports festival arc I've ever seen, but whatever. Boruto still exists. Indubitably. So there's time. Indubitably. Um, anything else, my friend? Hmm. I'm gonna say no. Coat friends. That's a reaction. Comment, like, subscribe. Tell a friend, yeah. tell a friend. Get to link you below. Join the socials. Subscribe to the Patreon. Uh, you get it fucking first on Patreon. Uncut, raw, and just... It's fucking good. It's a good-ass fucking time. That's what we get to Also, ladies. join the Discord. Raw? Hell yeah. Well. Um, <laughs> <laughs> join the Discord. Run the numbers up. NCD.com. Reanimated. Change your discount code. Yeah. Reanimated family. Stay classy. Reanimated. Out. Peace. All right, man, let's head, let's head to Norfolk, bro. Let's head to the other side of the water. What's over there for you? It's freedom, baby.